Especially when she reckless Remember you're my bestest friend Yeah, she my bestie uh -huh. And everything is alright I like how you're doing alright, alright Like how you think alright Always on top of you Oh my goodness. Okay, don't any water. There we go. Don't and, uh, there we got it. Oh, God. Uh, so we are outside. <laughs> we are outside? We are outside or we inside? <laughs> Imagine we're taking chicken lemon and making a line. Eh? <laughs> <laughs> this man had jokes, boy. Imagine we take grapefruit and make a line. Yeah. Harry crew, Captain Cucumber Face will lead you to the big fish and the treasure. What fish are you talking about? In 15 days we are out here, we can't catch a fish. Wasting time, diving, diving, diving. We are eating two weeks. We are eating all. We can't eat nothing. Silence! I am Captain. We will catch big fish. We can't take this again. Why throw you off the boat now, boy? Excuse me? Mutiny? I'm a new Captain. Who? Who do you all want as a new Captain? Mustak! You know what I mean? Get off my boat! Go kill him! Give me a hand. No! Give me a hand, there, man. Tie up. Come off my boat, man. No! No! I will be back! I will be back for you! Bye, go! But I'm gonna save him. I'm gonna save the man before he's dead. I'm gonna save him before he's dead. Well, as you could see, we live and direct on the North Coast now with Musta. You see, I'm reaching. Yeah. I finally, I finally build up the courage. I mean, I get all the gear and everything already. Yeah. But I've seen all of these things here, but I've seen these fins. Look at the size of these things now, boy. Long, long, long. Like, I see a special friend, but I realize you want to start a hair calm now. That's why you call it. You calling this calm? That is calm. Boy. Look at the waves here. <laughs> it's real choppy. What we have here, boy? What kind of fish do you think you'll get? Probably looking for a little cavalli. Um, pampano. Lucky my yeah, it could be a spectacle, trust me. In these kind of waters, whoo, let me get ready. Right, there we go. Let me saw right now. What's going on is that the fellas went down their cap. How deep we looking at right now? 30 feet, 40, 50. Right. Mustaka, Mustaka is pretty um, experienced in do it, doing this with he and his son. I mean, I've seen them pull some big monsters. Okay, two fellas on that side, I don't know whether if they caught any. So we are just going to be showing us how to do some nice roasted fish today. We have fresh aromatics, all those great spices from cheap brand teriyaki, the seafood seasoning, the fish seasoning. You really want to put that to work. You're really counting on these fellas at this point. Captain has to be very careful at this point in time. The waters are choppy. And I mean, we don't want any action at this point. Be precarious. What's going on here with you? <laughs> Talk to me. Cramp. Cramp. You get cramp. So that's what has happened sometimes when you go down there? Yeah, sometimes. That's why you have your leg up too? That's nice. Moose and they're still down there. You have faith in the man? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. What's this one now? This moonshine. Well, oh, let's take off the man eye, you know, boy. But this is a flat fish, right? A flat fish. Look at that shine on it, my boy. Ooh. I call it moonshine. Shine in the moonlight. Listen, hopefully we get some more. Those guys still underneath right now. Captain watching them. Um, let me see what's going on, Uncle. Now. Don't, don't, snapper. Yeah. don't snapper. 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 Don't snap
dog snapper? Dog teacher say it? Yeah, Look at that people. Okay, match we have ladies and we roast it up. Watch that the show starting now, you know, at this point in time. I'm hoping we get a group today. If we can get a group we just we didn't have one. Oh my god! What is that? Come on ladies, come on ladies. Bum, bum, <laughs> Hey, sir. Look at that ball. We are a monster. Boss, we can get action like this boy. I know people want this boy. Now, if you have to learn to do that, or you want to buy the equipment to do it, or you want advice on it, you have to come out and under. And we have it. We have everything for you, man. You just come and check me when you're ready. So it looks like we can see now shoot a, a small snapper there. Next one to, uh, to the pot. Yes, yes, yes. Pinky yeah. boy. Oh, yeah, oh, oh, oh. That is a snapper for them. Yeah. Yeah. What looking rich and nice. It's time to cook. Alright. I don't need to be greedy or anything like that. We go knock again. Tell us here. I told you to just get some barracuda here. Like Just coming in left the north coast and we come back into the west right now. <laughs> this is a spooky party carrying us in the idea. And they want me to jump out inside here too. This is the back cave. Hey! Oh my goodness. Okay, jump in the water. There we go. And and the there we got it. Oh god, the back. We're <laughs> inside. I like this one. Well, let's hold it off for me all the time, man. Five thousand, right? Five thousand, five hundred and sixty-five to be Come now, guys. Have right. an easier way to get him up. <laughs> up, 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 up. Oh, yeah. God, oh, wait, 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 wait. wait. <laughs> nah. Nah. On your belly, on your bumps. So, on your bumps. Daniel, come up. Daniel, come up. Boy, time. time to cook. Alright, so what we have is uh, this moonshine, right? Yeah. Alright, we get a couple of moonshines. I see a snapper. Nice fresh fish to make a little fall roast. We, we could really use this fish for. You use this for broth. You could roast it, you could fry it. Everything, boy, everything. It's, it shines in the, even Watch. in the sunlight, eh? Nice, thin, slender cuts. Obviously, going fast, what of a accordion finish. So, I guess this is all with the presentation. Most, what we have here? Some little leafy. Yeah. That going fire just so. And this is obviously the best way to cook it as soon as you get it fresh, right? Yeah. Just to put it on the grill. We have cheap brand spices in the house together with some other condiments. In the meantime, we're going to season this up. You're going to feel it, the snapper, huh? for the ceviche. Essentially, what you're trying to do is take the meat off of the main carcass. One side, pure meat, put it for the ceviche. Alright, so what we're doing now. The filet, of course, as you saw, again, ready all the fresh aromatics. We're going to be doing some roasted fish, some ceviche, some shadow benny at this point in time. We have some peppers, some fresh pimentos, purple onions, tomatoes, all the condiments from cheap brand products that we're going to use to enhance and embellish and really bring all the flavor of this whole island vibe going on. We're doing some nice purple onion. Right, so we finished filling the fish and we left with these pieces after we take out the bones and all the other little remaining pieces from the carcass. And then from here, we're just going to slice it. We're improvising with a little plastic bottle because we have a bowl. <laughs> but for now, it will work. And the ceviche obviously is the method where you cook with acid, mm -hmm. like a citrus based acid. Show us how we do it now. 
Well, first thing is to add the, the actual acid to the um, to the meat. That's grapefruit. So you want it to start to cook as soon as possible. Add a little bit more ah. grapefruit. From here, you could add in the um, red onion. Nice. Imagine we taking lemon and making a lime. Eh? <laughs> this man had jokes, boy. <laughs> Imagine we take grapefruit and make a lime. Yeah. So it reminds me of like a chow, eh? Okay. It's basically fish chow. If you really think about it. Well, today was a kind of commando cooking. You know? We're cooking like how we normally would cook when we am. Um, I mean, we normally, when we go to make a dive, we walk. So the, you are accustomed to this kind of lifestyle pretty much, right? Well, yeah, we walk with no bowl, we walk with no spoon, we walk with I no I see all they use a bottle to, yeah. uh, to mix this up. Let me put a little shot of the uh, tamarind hot sauce inside sure. you now. I think it will be nice, a little bit of tartiness. You're talking about this kind of citrus vibe all the time. Some nice diced tomatoes. So you're going for color also? Yeah. Um, i seen some yellow peppers if you're talking about color. Oh yeah, that's a brilliant idea. So we just put it inside here. Listen, it don't get as real as we outside here right now. Moose is a man who specializes when it comes into bushcraft craft cooking. Eh? <laughs> so, when you put the lemon juice, how long you have to pour the grapefruit juice? How long you have to let it wait for? Right? At least a half an hour or so. We all know, sure it is in there. Look, you can actually see everything is glazed nicely with all the spices inside there. It's starting to change composition in terms of the texture. Let me get ready. So, BJ, you smell nothing because I didn't bring nothing. What a catch! What's the trick here? What's the trick? The bunk's so long here. Woo! Jesus Christ. Look at the teeth on that. This is what it's about. When you're outside with moose. Level adventure, you know. What are we talking about? Woo! So it's a special tinder, and then we have some thing called a fuel tablet. Some more lighter, yeah? Once this light, no turning back. So this is Moose's uh, accordion fish. You're accustomed to doing this? Yep. I guess it's for presentation, right? And also it's for a lot of surface here with the, with the meat of the fish. So you get it seasoned nice and penetrated inside of it. Speaking of seasoning, let me start with some black pepper. Like my black pepper, they're wet, boy. We just had to rub it on at this point in time. The black pepper fall in the boat and get wet, but this is what does happen sometimes. I want to try and aim to get all in little nooks Gashes. and crannies. Paprika? Where is it? Paprika oh, still dry. Paprika nice and dry. Yeah, Can we go with some little bit of green seasoning also? This is like a spa treatment here we're going on, right? From pretty, what I see. Pretty much for the fish. <laughs> this fish was alive about an hour ago, so as it fresh like this, you must have a little bit of fresh seasoning. So right here we have a little bit of shadow Benny. Alright. So the pimentos garlic and stuff. and ginger. And that is the day you know people. As good as it is. And as you see, we want to roast this directly on the fire. So it's real roast fish again. Direct flame contact, so you get a very unique flavor that you wouldn't really get at home. This one I do another different. We're gonna start with just salt, black pepper. Chief has the Chinese seasoning. Rather than the traditional, just boring black pepper and salt, let's get a little bit of the Asian flavor inside here. You also have some teriyaki sauce. Teriyaki marries extremely well with the umami profiles in fish. Let's go with this one. Look, I don't like that one. Ready to try him? Ready to try him already? Ooh. Look at that, smell of that, look at that. When you open it up, as you can see, it's perfectly cooked. It's not dried, it's moist. And look at the character and the flavor. We know this is gonna have flavor, that little char. So, get in up now, boy. Oh my God. <laughs> 10 out of 10. I just want to treat a little different. Make some slashes inside of the fish itself. That is where the flavor could actually penetrate inside it, right? Salt inside of the cavity. And with some black pepper again. What we're going to do now, we're going to use the fish seasoning. This is great, even the seafood seasoning, but this one is actually geared towards, you know, freshly caught fish. So we're going to start to go. This has comprehensive spices inside of it. Rosemary, sage, oregano. A green seasoning again from Chief Brand. Rubbing it down nicely. And this is to prevent it from sticking on the grill, right? Yeah. And give it yeah, a nice shot. Nice Shannon Benny inside there. Maybe some purple onions. You want some garlic and ginger and pimentos? Bring them. Just bring a little, a little pinch. We have the olive oil on top. Look at that, guys. Nice. 
days have the skills, but I'm going to shoot that. So that's it full proof way of actually doing it if you have like no grill, you could just rest it. Yeah. Because the seals is a protection. Yeah. That's what we're talking about, guys. Look at this. Roasted fish. Yeah, some flies giving us some problems here, but that's all good. So this is the real Bushman roast fish. So this one is like a reverse season. So you really don't need to skin it when you're going and roast it? No. If you're skinned, it's going to burn up all the skin. It's cooked so nice, Moose. Mm -hmm. Salt. And then you go with the lemon on top? Yeah. That's what we're talking about, guys. Totally different, yeah? Perfectly cooked. It's a different flavor altogether when it's cooked in the actual char, when the wood, whether it be charcoal. Bounce. Repeat it up and then get the fellas to come and eat. Let's come and eat, man. You're not bettering on it. Moose, I hate to say it, but you really deliver, boy. <laughs> I mean, I create a whole spread, you and your crew here. We're down in Scotland Bay right now. Yeah. Obviously, we went and dive in two, three locations on the North Coast this morning, bring it back. I was amazed and blown mind to see how something straight from the ocean, one hour ago, it tastes so fresh and vibrant. And a little bit of the help of the fresh aromatic and spices from cheap brand, we brought it home. What Trey and Tobago is about, good food, Caribbean vibes, and this is what we outside brings to you at this point in time. But that's really ready to eat this uh, roast fish? Yeah, yeah man. Oh. Of I like course, the smoky effects and all it really pushes. It's like 4D and 3D. Take some beauty shots. On the early old talk. Black and white. We tell you what the boat's going to bring it to me. Guys, that's it there for now. We'll see you all in the next episode. Moose and the whole family. Don't right. forget in the summer. We out. Sir, we outside. Don't do that to me! That time, my hand to you. I'll cut, I'll yeah, cut I'll before. Be back. <laughs> I'll be back. <laughs> yeah, I'll do that. Yeah. <laughs> I'll be back and then. Don't give me the top. Okay, nah, you don't want to come in the bottom. You're going to reach up quick. It's <laughs> Captain Piggy. Action, action, big fish. Action, action, big fish. Where was I? Where do you want to laugh? Put on that. Put on that, put on that. You gonna listen to me now? Take a bath. Yes, yes, Captain. <laughs> Alright, time for me to go and get some fish. Let me go, fellas. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>